Welcome to your second time trial club. Now, last week we started with a warm up. Do you remember what the warm up was called? What about here? Do you remember what the warm up was called? One, two, three, four, five. Well, it was just one, two, three, wasn't it? Good. One, two, three. Uh, anyone at home, can you remember what number one was? What about here? What was number one? Breathe. Breathe. Fantastic. Uh, everyone at home, what was number two? Over here, what was number two? Sit down. Good, sit down. Are we going to jump up and sit right down? No. No, we're going to carefully. Up. Exactly. And everyone at home, number three. Can you remember what number three was? Anyone here? Mm. Hopping. Hopping on one leg. Was it hopping on one leg? No. What was it, everyone at home? Well done, it was balancing on one leg. So we're trying to keep nice and still. Now, last week I said that we will add more numbers in, okay? So, we're going to add number four in, okay? Number four, are you ready for number four? Yeah. Are you ready for number four? Yeah. Okay, number four is you need to touch both hands on the floor and then you're going to carry on moving the same way that you were moving. Okay? So likely, like one, two and three, you have to do something like number one, freeze and stay there. Okay? With number four, as soon as you touch both hands on the floor like this, you can carry on going and moving around. Okay, does everyone understand that? Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. And we've got number five. Number five is similar to number four in that you have to keep going after you've done it. Okay? But number five is if you're going this way, you hear number five, you've got to change direction and go a different way. So if you hear five, you might be going that way. Number five, and go this way. Okay? So anytime you hear number five, you have to change direction. You understand? Yeah. Remember, everyone at home, you can pause the video to get yourself ready. Everyone here, are you ready? Yeah. Fantastic. Okay, stand up. And uh, today, I want you to start with high knees. So I want you to get your knees up nice and high as you're moving. That's it. That's it. Get those knees up nice and high. Everyone at home, get those knees up nice and high, nice and high. Number one. Are you frozen? Are you frozen? You can't laugh if you're frozen. You can't laugh if you're frozen. Okay, this time we're going to kick up our put your hands to the back like this. And you're going to keep your heels up. And that's it. Yeah. On one leg. Were you all balancing? Yeah. 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 
frozen. Then 
after your bear walk, remember, it's not over, you've then got to run back to the beginning. And only then does your time stop. Okay? Okay, everyone at home, I'm now going to show you what you can do if you've only got a small space to work in. Okay? So you're still going to do all four activities, all four movements, but we're going to cut it down a bit. Okay? So the first one was a crawl. So you're going to crawl to the first section. Then you're going to do your pencil crawl all the way around like this until you get here. Now, if that's all the space you've got, don't panic. You can go back to the beginning and now you can start your third section, which was the shuffle like this, like this, like this, like this. And then the fourth section is the army, I think, not the army, is the bear walk like this, like this. And then you can run back and then your time stops. Okay? Now remember, you can pause the video at any time to get yourself set up and ready to go. Now, can we all remember the four different movements? Can you remember? Let's see if you can. Movement number one, what was it? Yes. Good, it was a crawl, wasn't it? Did you get that? Yeah, of course you did. Okay, number two, what was number two?